There's a similar. Uh, I've been thinking about C.S. Lewis and Tolkien lately, and I don't think that Lewis is preachy, but I do think he pushes the allegory too far. So I often in, find in, it. You mean like Narnia? Narnia. I'm about to read the space trilogy for August. Mm. That's what I've set myself. I'm really excited. Well, to get Narnia. Into it, I'm but... thinking we can give him a little credit for that because it's a children's book. That's right. Yeah. And then, so if something is written for children, you're allowed to be, you know. Because actually, you know, yeah, it was funny. I was driving home. I take Matt to but Divine. But the, Hob the Hobbit is a children's book, and that wasn't. Yeah, it, it, though it was interesting. When I was driving home with Matt from Divine, when we have Divine Liturgy during the week, which I love, we can do. So usually once a week they have it uh, down in uh, Irving, yeah. Texas. And so we'll drive about a half hour to go to that. And it's usually small, only about five people there. Nice. And so it's just an intimate setting. Just have Still the an hour and a half or what? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, but it's great. Yeah. And so we, we do that. We were driving home and he was asking me like, God, he said, Dad, why do you think the devil uh, rebelled against God? Do you think it's because he, he was like, God just bosses people around and I don't want to have to do that. Like if God bosses people around, maybe he's not so good. And I said, well, yeah, Matt, maybe if he did do that, but do you think God is like that? Who do you think God is like? And we were talking about different examples. Like, what kind of a king is mm -hmm. God like? And I said, well, actually, because we, we, he mentioned like a bad king from a film. And I said, well, maybe he's more like, I said, Matt, do you know who I think God is like in, in like a story? He said, like who? I said, he's like Aslan. Mm. He's like, yes, in Narnia. And I'm like, there you go. Yeah. And so I think when you have those good stories, it works. But but yeah, I mean, the, the Narnia series, take it for what it is. But it is why I, I do wonder what has reached more people Hmm. This is a good question for David Bates over Pints with Jack. What has reached more people to introduce them to Christianity, the Narnia series or mere Christianity? Hmm. Now, probably still mere Christianity, but bo both have had a huge impact. That's why, I mean, I don't know, maybe when I'm on vacation, I, I had this fiction book I was working on. I stopped it like five years ago, but maybe I'll start again. I think you sent it to me. Did it begin in a math class or some sort of schoolroom? Yes, yeah, that was the, bits, that was the first it. chapter. Hey, thanks so much for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment below letting us know what you thought about the video.